Hey guys, today is uh, Tuesday, March 21st. Um, it's spring. Fishing report here for you today. Uh, we got the lake levels at 651. It's still low. Um, we really need some rain. Uh, put a little color in the water, that would help us out. Water temp's about 55 degrees up to 63 in the backs of some of the creeks with the dirty water. Uh, fish are definitely in pre-spawn mode. Um, got a couple different things that are working. Uh, had a boat fishing trip and got to see all the males up shallow. Uh, it's kind of early, earlier than normal, but um, we'll take it. Uh, we had snow last week and it's almost in the 80s the last couple days so fishing's only going to get better they're coming up shallow they're going to get ready to spawn uh, they're not all the way in the backs of the creeks but they're almost to the backs of the creeks and the flats uh, they're still holding off a little bit and there's a couple different things that are working uh, depending on the weather conditions uh, the weather is going to be the biggest factor this time of the year. You've got, uh, you know, the days when it's snowing, uh, or if you got bluebirds, there's a couple things that, that are working. Still haven't put the jerk bait away. Uh, throwing a mega bass is working. Uh, mixed sticks working. Also throwing a shaky head. If you don't have, any, if you got little wing guys, or if it's bluebirds. Uh, you can catch a lot of fish on a shaky head right now or in that rig. Um, another thing that, that's working is a swim bait. Just a little Kitek swim bait on a small, small head. Uh, just casting it along the docks, the outside of the docks. Uh, they're, they're on the transition banks, um, whether it's... Uh, Going into the spawning pocket, whether it's a point, the fish seem to be on the sides of the points, or where it goes from bluff wall to gravel, or bluff wall to chunk rock, or chunk rock to clay, doesn't matter. Um, look for those changes in the in the rock, and you're gonna you're gonna get bit. Um, uh, shallow, I don't. I, I don't think I've fished anything deeper than 15 foot and probably won't have to here for the next month. Um, if you've got wind, if you've got clouds, if you've got rain, you can do a couple different things. Um, you can still power fish. Um, throw in the wiggle wart a little bit, that bite is going to slow down here um, as the water temp rises. Uh, wiggle wart or rock claw. Um, whatever colors accommodate the water you're fishing, the brighter colors and the dirtier water, and the more natural colors in the clear water. Um, also, catching a lot of fish on a jig right now. Um, the steeper banks leading into the spawning pockets are holding a lot of fish. Um, holding the boat in 10, 15 foot of water and hitting the bank. Um, just working it back uh, nice and slow and they're just loading up on it. They're really on that jig bite uh, right now from this end of the lake. Uh, one other thing that's been going is I put on a little uh, Kitek. This is a little different. It's got the, uh, this is an owner flashy and it's got the uh, I call it like a finesse spinner bait. That's working in the backs of the creeks right now. Um, if you got that dirty water, you can add a little color in there, adds a little flash, as opposed to just working just the regular Kitek swim bait. And word of the day is walleye. You guys probably got another week for jerk baiting for the walleyes. It's the last couple hours of the day. Um, the last hour before the sun goes down and the hour afterward. The guys get out there, throw your jerk baits around the points, the main lake points, the secondary points, um, and they're shallow. They're up there doing their thing. Um, 
18 inches, limit of four. Uh, the white bass are kind of tapering off a little bit. They're, some of them are moving out of the creeks already. Um, you'll find them on the secondary points. If you're out early or if you're out late, you'll see them popping. Um, walleye guys, you know, if you want a shot at it, uh, give us a call. We'll get someone to get you out. Um, jerk bait for some walleyes. Thanks for watching and have fun. Thank you.